So for the announcers of the 1970s, WHA, NHL, US, this guy was, name was mispronounced so many times it was kind of a running joke. Alan Hangsleben, or Hangsleben, uh, was one of the better defensemen to come out of the NCAA in the early 1970s. Now, he was drafted in the fourth round, 56 overall in the 73 NHL amateur draft, and by the Whalers in the fourth round, 51st overall in the 73 WHA draft. Now, a very, very personable guy. Uh, University of North Dakota at the time was starting to develop as an international program, and um, he was scouted allegedly before he was playing with the U.S. national team. His last season with University of North Dakota, he had 25 points in 34 games. And again with the U.S. national squad, kind of a prep for the 76 Olympics, he had 5 points in 7 games. Now, he started his career, he decided to sign with New England. Uh, and he started his career with probably the best hockey name of all time, the Cape Codders. I've seen jerseys for the Cape Codders, they're just beautiful, of the North American Hockey League. He had 43 points in 55 games. Big call up to the Whalers for the playoffs. He had 26 games in the regular season. Three assists in the playoffs. Now, he had one more game with the Cape Carters in um, 76. Uh, and uh, eventually, in his, uh, it was in his rookie season because he had 26 games before. But his second full campaign with the Whalers, he had 25 points in 78 games. 77, consistent, uh, 22 points, 13 goals. 78-79 with the, uh, the Whalers. And he did make the jump to uh, uh, Hartford as part of the Whalers franchise. But eventually found himself in Washington where he played parts of three seasons and put up consistent numbers. He was a 10-15 to 15 goal uh, a year uh, uh, defenseman and uh, known for his production in the playoffs because in New England he had put up some really solid numbers. Now, unfortunately, he never played a playoff game in the NHL, but he was uh, he played uh, with Hartford. That's the same team that played Montreal in the playoffs. But he was gone to Washington uh, later on. Now he wrapped up his career in the NHL in 1982 with eight points in 18 games with the Kings, and then uh, ended up with the New Haven Night Nighthawks. Now, what's nice about this, he has a New Brunswick connection, ladies and gentlemen. He played part of the 82-83 season with the very very popular Moncton Alpines. He had five goals and 14 assists for 19 points for the AHL team that year. And uh, he liked taking a penalty, too. He wasn't scared to drop the, the gloves, by the way. And he wrapped up his career in 84 with the New Haven Nighthawks, who had played two seasons before with uh, a goal to, uh, and 23 assists for 24 points. Uh, again, WHA totals, 109 points in 334 games. NHL, 69 points in 185 games. Again, a career of 500 games. Combined in WHA NHL level, and again, uh, he decided WHA for for him because again, Montreal was drafting defensemen. No room in Montreal. Broken record. Have a good evening. Keep your stick in the ice. Bye.